Skip counting lets you count by multiples of two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, or even more. It's a great way to learn to multiply numbers together. Let's give it a try. Let's do skip counting by threes. It means you only count every third number. Watch me do it. You'll hear me bounce three times, but I only count every third number I land on. Three. Six. Nine. Twelve. Fifteen. Eighteen. Twenty-one. Twenty-four. Twenty-seven. Thirty. Let's do it again. This time, I'll count the bounces, and you count the number I land on after the third bounce. Remember to keep silent after the first two bounces, because we're skipping those numbers. One, two, three. 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 You can do skip counting yourself with a pen and a piece of paper. You can draw arrows to represent the bounces and circle every third number. Let's use skip counting by threes to count the number of balloons that cross the dotted line. Remember only to call out the number of every third balloon that crosses the line. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, Twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty. Let's do it one more time without numbers on the balloons. Count them off in groups of three as they cross the dotted line. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen. Twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty. If you can do skip counting, it makes learning the times tables easier. Skip counting by threes and the three times table both involve counting in multiples of three. Three times one is three. Three times two is six. Three times three is nine. Three times four is twelve. Three times five is fifteen. Three times six is eighteen. Three times seven is twenty-one. Three times eight is twenty-four. Three times nine is twenty-seven. Three times ten is thirty. Three times eleven is thirty-three. Three times twelve is thirty-six. <laughs> 